right, hello guys, here is my setup tour. Uh, so we got a three monitor setup. We got this beautiful Shure SM7, SM7B microphone, amazing mic. Uh, for this controller guys, this is the, the PS5 scuff with the digital triggers. I'm not sure exactly what the controller is called, but it has digital triggers, amazing. We got my camera, this is, this is what I record with. The uh, light for the camera also. Uh, this monitor right here, this is the gaming monitor that I'm always on. This is the 360 hertz Asus monitor. Then the other two on the sides are 240 hertz monitors. And then these, all oh, this headset guys, beautiful headset. It's it's like only a hundred dollar headset and it's just a HyperX like cloud bet or I don't, remember, I don't remember what it's called, but it's a really good headset, super loud. And then for the mic, this is what everyone's been using. This is the Logitech Superlight Pro 2. Uh, everyone's on that on that mouse. This is just some random $30 like Amazon keyboard that I got. And yeah, guys, that's pretty much the setup. Nothing too special. And yeah, that's it. Yo, this is Den Silent, and here's my setup toy. So on the very right, there's all my controllers. With the four controllers on the right being TikTok shop controllers that I did videos on. Three of the PS4 controllers on my left are custom hex controllers with paddles on the back. With the completely brand new hex controller in the box right there as well. And this is my current Galaxy hex controller that I use right now. And this is my 65% HyperX keyboard that I use for one of my PCs. Along with my 144Hz ASUS monitor. Right in the middle of my setup is a Star Wars picture frame that my girlfriend got for me as a gift. With both of our names on it. Because I'm a fan of Star Wars. Then there's my PS5 that I use for PS5 console tournaments to make videos on. And right below that's my Logitech G203 Prodigy. And for my gaming PC, I have another HyperX keyboard, but one of my keycaps broke, so that's why it's missing. With a 240Hz Dell monitor. And on the right side is the camera that I use for my hand cams, which is a Razer Kia. And on the very far left of my setup is my mini Gold XLR that I use for streaming, along with my microphone, which is the HyperX Quadcast. It's a really great mic. And I never liked headsets for gaming, so I use HyperX earbuds that feel really comfortable in my ear. And on the right side underneath my desk is my gaming PC, which is a GeForce 3060 RTX. And finally, this is the chair that I use is a respawn gaming chair, but I've had it for a few years, so now I use a pillow for it because it's not that comfortable anymore. And that's everything for my setup. Yo, what's so up, guys? Walking through the Zyro setup now. Excuse the mess because I have just finished my stream, so I've got stuff absolutely everywhere. I apologize, but we got the Christmas tree here for the uh, the Christmas vibes. But going into the setup. Starting off with the monitors on the left hand side here, I've got a 1080p MSI 144Hz. Then for the middle monitor, which is the holy grail, this is the Asus OLED 240Hz 0.03 milliseconds response time monitor. This thing is an absolute machine, probably hands down one of the best, if not the best monitor on the market right now. And this is just the most smoothest experience that I've ever seen on Call of Duty Warzone. It is insane. And over here on the right side, we do have the LG uh, 144Hz 1440p monitor. This was the monitor that I was playing on before I went over to the OLED 240Hz. But yeah, this, this thing was uh, awesome, man. So this is now my OBS slash Google monitor. This is everything to, you know to do with the stream and stuff like that. Then moving over to the absolute beauty of my gaming PC. Shout out to Paradox Customs for sorting this out. We have the 4090 paired with the 13900K. We've got the streamer cables from Lian Lee, Li, and this is the H9 flow case, I'm pretty sure. Uh, as you can see here on the right hand side, we do have the YouTube plaque paired with uh, a couple of scuff controllers right there but yeah like i said i have literally just finished the stream right now so it is uh very messy i apologize but uh we've got the the stream tree right here uh these are all the people that have been uh donating and uh, gifting subs to the stream so shout out to all these guys and uh this is the controller that i'm currently using right now this is the joe scuff shout out to joe this thing is very clean kind of goes with like the whole vibe with like the blue in the room and stuff like that so this is very nice then moving over to the keyboards now i obviously don't use keyboards when i'm playing uh, i am a controller player as you can see um but with the keyboards that i do have uh, i've got the logitech keyboard headset and mouse all as like a, a trio right here uh, this is the brand new uh, pro x2 keyboard the pro x2 headset and the super light 2 mouse absolutely insane headset quality is awesome i can hear footsteps perfectly uh, when i'm playing call of duty warzone we've got a mini stream deck here which to be fair i don't actually use that much but it is very helpful for transitioning your scenes and if you want to you know play and pause music with spotify and stuff like that uh, i've got my uh, astro mix amp and my GoXLR right here. 
these two are brilliant for audio. This one is actually to do with my personal audio. So if I want to turn something down for myself, this is what I use and this is what the stream hears. So yeah, this is a necessity if you do have a, a dual PC setup, which I will be showing you guys in a minute, as you can see it is just down there. Uh, so yeah, GoXLR is awesome. Uh, I have the Elgato low profile. Um, just get this out of the way. I have the Elgato low profile uh, microphone arm. Absolutely amazing. Looks really sleek. Goes right underneath the monitors, which works perfect with my setup. We have the Shure SM7B microphone. This is without doubt one of the best, if not the best, uh, streaming microphones. Uh, the price for this is a little bit higher than most microphones, but it is 100% worth it. The quality is insane. Uh, we do have for the second keyboard, we've got the Rock App mouse and keyboard. Uh, don't really use these too much. This is just for like my streaming, uh, my streaming screens right here. Uh, and then going underneath the desk, this is the streaming PC. We have a 3080 Ti paired with an 11900K. This was my old gaming PC. Uh, and then Paradox and Zen were absolute goats and sorted me out with the brand new 4090 build. So this is now my streaming PC. And this is absolutely insane for a streaming PC, man. Like I literally don't need anything better. It is crazily overkill for a streaming PC, but I know I'm not gonna run into any issues, but we do have like the blue theme going on there. Cable management is absolutely terrible. I apologize, but that, wraps up the setup. If we do want to just go on to the uh, the back here, the um, monitor stands that I do have is the Envisions, and these things are really great. I've got a single one here, so I've got free roam of this monitor, and then the dual for the vertical and the gaming monitor right here. But yeah, this is what I read my chat off, this is what I game off, and this is what my OBS is on. We do have the Elgato key lights around the back here. We've got the Elgato key lights, which are awesome for lighting. I've got one facing away for sort of background lighting and one for my face right here. We do have the Elgato Face Cam Pro. Uh, this is the 4K, uh, the 4K camera, amazing quality. Definitely recommend that. Probably the best webcam you can get on the market before you start paying uh, for, you know, the more expensive cameras. But yeah, that about wraps up my setup. I'll just uh, take a little stand back here so you guys can see it in all its glory. Like I said, third time i apologize for all the mess <laughs> but this is what my room looks like after a stream there's stuff all over the place so yeah there you go i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll catch you the next one Yo, it's Cam SMH. Just wanted to do a quick setup tour here. So take a walk into my room. You got the beautiful background. So these are essentially just Gogi lights behind some cotton that's kind of glued to the wall. Gives it a cool lightning like effect. Um, you can do different effects with these lights. I typically just leave them still just so they don't mess too much with the camera. And of course, we got the Zen Nano Leafs. Right there in the back wall, we got some acoustic panels kind of around it just to give it a little bit more flavor. We also have a cat who decided to disturb me during this video. But right there, you got my secret lab chair. That's where all the magic happens. That's a cat bed. Utility here. I got the PlayStation. This is kind of a mess right now, but I'm trying to move some stuff around. We got the PlayStation right here. We got my gaming PC right here. That right there is my streaming PC. It's not on, but you probably get the idea. That's the gaming PC kind of stuck behind there. And then over here, again, is where all the magic is happening. So I have four monitors. The gaming monitor, which is right there. This right monitor is simply for Spotify, Discord, or anything kind of miscellaneous like that. And then those two monitors right there for my stream. So I have my Twitch stream up on that one with my chat and all the activities that go on over there. And then on the top one I use for my TikTok chat and all the activities that go on over there. And we got the ring light back there. We got the camera that kind of points through these two monitors. So that's a Sony A6400 camera. There's my uh, assistant rubbing his face against my chair. 
We have a mic, that's an Audio-Technica BP40. Um, it's a pretty high-end studio mic, kind of like the Shure SM7B. Then we got the GoXLR over there for all my sound, right there to my left. I got the keyboards for the two PCs, and then my headset right there is the Astro E40s. And as you can see down there, that's a foot pedal for my aimbot. Um, but that's about it. Not very good cable management, but it works. It's a big desk. I think this desk is over 100 inches long. It kind of covers up that whole back wall. So that's pretty much it for my stuff. What's going on, guys? My name is E. Harvey, and I'm a content creator for Zen. Uh, I play Fortnite, and this is my current setup. Uh, I just got this PC from Paradox Customs. It has a 4090 and i9 13900K. Um, and this is my streaming PC with a 3016 and Ryzen 9 5900X. I use a Go XLR Mini along with the uh, boom arm and Shure mic. Um, this is my gaming controller, regular just mouse and keyboard, nothing special. And then the DT990 Pros and I have a vertical monitor set up with a 240 hertz on the bottom and 144 hertz on top. And yeah guys, this is my current gaming setup. <laughs>